three to one the final score tonight new york red bulls two going to two two and one on the season with a win over orlando city b which drops to one three and one the red bulls players greeting their fans after the win tonight and a lot of familiar faces and hometown hugs you could tell for some of the players with longtime ties to the area and a couple of Orlando City players fall in that category as well. New York Red Bulls, too, with the win. They started it in the first half. Junior Fleming's early. Yeah, Junior Fleming's very active throughout the match, but a nice little bit of poise right here to be able to create some separation. Best court feeding him the ball. Really nice pass, kind of dissecting the center backs over there. But Orlando City responded back very well. They had some big moments. Dequa being denied here by Evan Loro. Uh, but Orlando City building and building with confidence. Dequa eventually putting this one away. Nice feed off the left foot of De Silva, cutting the center backs in half. Red Bull responding back in stoppage time. Bill Yu feeding right here. And Bezcourt, who had the assist on the first one, beautifully slotted there at the back post. Nothing that Earl Edwards, who did such a good job uh, throughout most of the match, has been so solid for Orlando City this year. Nothing he could do on that one. The second half, Jonathan, I think we both agree, perhaps not quite as free-flowing uh, as the first half was, but uh, it, it was something that Red Bull had to do where they had to dig deep, they had to churn out. Uh, there were some injuries, there were some knocks, but eventually they were able to get things going and able to put away the third goal there on a set piece. Zach Carroll with that tackle on Junior Fleming's. And it was a clean tackle. Again, we thought the officials had it right, and that free kick caught everybody in purple by surprise. David Abador finishing from Bezicourt's delivery. A goal and two assists for the 23-year-old Frenchman, Vincent Bezicourt. He leads the USL in scoring, and he leads the Red Bulls, too, to the 3-1 win tonight. Yeah, you think best court there is, is, is making a really big statement that he wants more inclusion, not just on the USL level. He wants a look at the MLS squad. He's knocking on the door, John Wallenek told us. And if tonight's performance is any indication, he absolutely is. The New York Red Bulls 2-3 and Orlando City B-1. The final for us tonight from the MSU Soccer Park at Montclair State University in New Jersey. That's going to do it for our show. Thanks so much for tuning in tonight. Goals from Junior Fleming's Vincent Bezicourt and David Abador give the Red Bulls 2 a 3-1 win. For my partner Christian Dyer, our entire crew here at the MSU Soccer Park, I'm Jonathan Yardley. Thanks for watching. Good night from New Jersey. Red Bulls 2 with the win. And a big thank you to Paul Hawkins.